going to Paris. Paris. I did a catering run yesterday and now I'm about to pick up some food from a restaurant. It's late tonight, it's an overnight flight. We get to Paris at around, I think we land at two, be at the hotel by four, and I'm hitting the road instantly. My first stop naturally was caffeine. Bonjour, we just got to the hotel, but my room is not ready. So I'm in the little bar area and the pilots are gonna meet me down here. Their rooms are ready and we're gonna have a little cocktail to start our Parisian layover. All right, welcome to my hotel room. We have finally, finally made it. <sighs> there are no words for how happy and excited I am to be in Paris, France. It's one of my favorite places in the entire world. And slippers and a robe, I love that. Let's go check out my view. I'm supposed to have an Eiffel Tower view. Look what I see. Oh my gosh, I'm just so excited. I've been here a million times. It's exciting every single time. And then if we can focus, the Arc de Triomphe is right there. And if you have been watching my vlogs for a while, uh, my family's name is actually on the Arc de Triomphe. So I'm gonna take a walk over there and take a picture with it. I do that every time I'm in Paris and it's yet to get old. I'm just so happy. I have the biggest smile on my face. This is the best layover ever. I love Paris. Good morning. It is a very rainy morning here in Paris, France, but that is not going to stop me. I'm getting ready. I'm maybe meeting the pilots for coffee. I don't know, but I'm going to go walk around and just enjoy the city as much as I can for the time that I'm here.
<laughs> that was a ton of lightning. I was just gonna say we're back at the hotel at the perfect time. It is a crazy monsoon out there. I've been so focused on the Eiffel Tower and the Arc de Triomphe from my hotel balcony that I didn't even realize you can see Sacre Coeur from here too. One of our pilots ended up sleeping in, so me and the second pilot went for breakfast this morning. And now the sleepy pilot just woke up. He wants to do lunch. I am not ready for lunch, but I'm gonna meet him downstairs in the lobby just to say good morning. And then I'm gonna take an Uber and go, and actually my sneakers, <laughs> here they are, um, that I'm wearing on this trip, I picked up in France a few years ago when me and my husband came for vacation from that store. Sorry, there's some sirens. Anyway, I'm going shopping. We're at the supermarket picking out some lunch. We are back. I didn't get rained on too much. I did some great shopping and now the guides are going for a run. I think I'm just gonna sit on that incredible patio and read for an hour and then we are meeting for dinner. The restaurant that we're going to is called Chez Gabrielle and it's a two minute walk from our hotel. And then I think we're gonna walk around the city a little bit and just kind of check out the area that we're in a little more. We did say we wanna do some touristy things. We're talking about going to the catacombs one of these days and doing a river cruise down the scene. So that will be fun. I love being a tourist and doing the touristy things and I love every single thing in Paris, even though I've said it before to you, I've been here before. It's just one of my favorite cities in the entire world. So I want to see everything, do everything, and eat everything. And speaking of eating, those were the best strawberries I've ever had in my entire life. I wish I could take them home. Oh my gosh, they were so good. I've never eaten a strawberry that tastes that good, ever. I wanted to show you a few things from my little shopping trip today. Um, I have a bag full of stuff. The most exciting takeaways. Mini bags are really having a moment. I thought this one was so cute, so tiny for summer. So I picked that up and then I did find, I'm so happy, those sneakers that I love. I got myself a replacement pair. These are the most comfortable sneakers and 14 euro. You cannot beat that price. And then I got myself a cute pair of yellow loafers which isn't really like me, but I need to show you something that I'm wearing today. So I have my little scarf and I'm just gonna put a blazer on over this top and I've got my yellow detail and I think I'm gonna wear those yellow loafers with my outfit for dinner. I'll be freshening up because it was really hot even though it was raining, um, but I think I just changed my outfit completely with a pair of 18 euro shoes. Okay, I've decided to wear these shoes around my hotel room just because I don't wanna be breaking in a new pair of shoes on the streets of Paris. So here's what the outfit situation, can I get it all in there? Will look like tonight. The pilot's run took a little bit longer than expected. So I'm walking to dinner to hold our table. They should be there any minute. It tastes good, just thinking about it. It tastes good.
morning. I am up and dressed for the day and I'm just getting ready to meet the guys. We are on our way to, well, coffee, always first coffee, um, but we are going to go to the Louvre today and then I think we're gonna hit the catacombs after. So action-packed day, it's gonna be a ton of fun. Hello, we are back. We had a fun day, a long day, a lot of walking. I am tired. I checked my watch. We did nine miles today. Yesterday we did 10 miles. I just hope I come back and I'm very skinny. So I've decided I still have more time on this layover. In order not to bore you, I'm gonna break the vlog up into two parts. So I'm ending the beginning of my layover here. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel. This way you catch my Paris layover part two. And if you could give me and the Eiffel Tower a thumbs up, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you for everything. Paris is the best and I'll continue talking to you from Paris for one more week.